Hey guys, Mikhail Ranch Outdoors here. Today I am going to be burbot fishing. I'm hoping to catch at least one burbot for the sunset bite. I went out yesterday and I was able to actually get a really big four and a half pound burbot. And so right now I'm just trying to do the same thing, see if I can't get at least one. So stay tuned. Right now we're getting bites on this rod. see this is a beautiful beautiful like leopard like colors on this thing absolutely beast of a fish this looks like maybe a three and a half pounder just such a cool looking fish hey guys Mikhail Ranch Outdoors here so basically what ended up happening is I just got the one burbot it was a pretty slow night but I was super stoked to at least catch one fish so for this episode, I'm going to be doing a catch and cook with that burbot. And basically I'm just going to be skinning the burbot as you would a catfish. And then you just peel off the skin with pliers. And then the backbone is actually kind of like an inverted triangle, kind of like this shape. So I'll just be filleting the meat off the sides of that. I'm going to be skipping the filleting process. And then after I have the meat done, then I'm going to be boiling them in water. And after that, I will be dipping the boiled burbot meat into melted butter. And this is actually very, very good tasting. It's very much so like lobster or crab. It's just absolutely amazing to eat. So I'm going to be doing that and then I will show the burbot after it has been fully cooked. So stay tuned. All right, so now the skin has been peeled off. As you can see, you can kind of just see a little bit of uh, the actual muscle tissue of the burbot. So the next step is there's actually a long dorsal spine uh, that goes along here. So there's some really long dorsal rays. And then there's also a very similar anal fin ray uh, segment that continues on the bottom right along here. So what you're gonna do is just take your pliers and yank out every single one of these rays. And then after that, you will be cutting alongside the backbone right along here for this side and right along this side to get the meat. All right, so sadly you do not get a lot of meat off of these burbot. Uh, this is kind of just, this is what the flays look like. Basically you're just getting two big back straps off of either side of the burbot's backbone. Now, some people do cut out the belly meat, but I have read online, there's articles that say that's where a lot of the toxins are stored in the burbot. So for that reason, I don't save the belly meat of the burbot. All right, so now let's get to boiling it and trying it in some melted butter. So basically when the fish are boiling, you will see kind of like this. You're gonna see the chunks just going up and down with the water as it boils. That means the burbot are done boiling. And this goes for just about any fish species. When you're boiling the meat, if it starts going up with the water, it means it's done. All right, so the burbot finished boiling. And as you can see, 
it's just absolutely amazing looking. I got the melted butter. And honestly, I'm expecting it's going to be amazing. I already know what it's gonna taste like. I've already caught quite a few throughout my fishing career, but honestly, burbot is definitely my favorite freshwater fish to eat. So I'm just gonna taste it. Honestly, that is 10 out of 10 flavor. It's absolutely amazing. If you've never had a burbot, it tastes a lot like a lobster. Maybe even a lobster mixed with a crab kind of taste. I'd highly encourage and recommend you try and ice fish for burbot. If you don't really know how, just do a lot of Googling and research. And really that's just kind of how I got started burbot fishing. Once you catch one, you'll usually catch more. So I am going to try and make more catch and cook videos. Let me know in the comments below if you enjoyed this one. And I am also going to be focusing on more fishing videos as well in the coming months as I have more time available. As always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more fishing adventures and catching cooks on Mikhail Ranch Outdoors. Thanks for watching.